I've been working in the theater for many years and kept hearing about this book, Act One, and I was very late coming to it. And I read it, it must have been in my 40s, and um, I was just uh, so struck by it when I read it. There's a reason why it's a staple of theater lovers everywhere. It struck me, the parallels, even way back then, of Moss Hart working with George S. Kaufman, what it's like to be a young person working with a legend in our business and what that experience is like. Where did you get that? You said that to me! We were talking about gossip once! Well, I think unlike Moss Hart, who always wanted to be in the theater and at a young age uh, had that chance meeting with George S. Kaufman, uh, for me, I uh, just began in the theater, as I said, uh, not that knowledgeable about it. So when I met Steve Sondheim, I perhaps wasn't intimidated because I didn't know his work that well. I mean, it certainly resonates with uh, theater audiences and uh, theater lovers, but it goes beyond that too, I think. It's, it's, uh, it's a story about, you know, sort of following one's passion relentlessly and uh, being, um, you know, just sort of holding on to a dream and, and working diligently, just going all in, putting every ounce of, uh, of energy and focus and concentration on, on that kind of work. I felt very personal about uh, reading Act One, and I think it's why it's so exciting to people in the theater, because I think everybody sees themselves in the book a little bit.